This monthly minute is brought to you by Springtime. Let's get out this window here. Look at this green tree, people. 75, 80 degrees out here. It's been, those trees have been sticks for months and the city is rebounding and springtime is a bit of a metaphor. Sorry for the noise, the soundtrack comes with it, guys. Um, springtime is a bit of a metaphor for how the city is rebounding right now economically, loosening COVID restrictions. There is a spirit of hope, a return to normalcy, hopefully. Uh, the mayor has uh, decreed that uh, July 1 will be fully reopened. I'm not sure how that all turns out in the details, but if you recall, we are scheduled for a September fully blown launch of the church plant. So what does that mean? You may think, oh, we're fully launched. Um, we're actually not a fully launched church plant. What do we not have? We're not doing any kids ministry. We have not signed any membership covenants. We have not installed our elder team, which is significant. It's how each local church body is led. And we have not um, taken any communion and baptism together as a church, which are marks of the church. So these missing pieces are going to be fully put in place as we fully launch the church plant in September. That remains to be done. Uh, and this is the big news I shared with our church on Sunday, that we are officially out of space and cannot launch in our current venue. So let me show you these uh, photos. This is last Sunday and the one before. As you can see, we are out of space. There is no space to bring a friend. So it is nonsensical to say that we're gonna launch in that present space. There's nowhere to launch into. You're gonna hit a wall, literally. There's no place to put anyone. Because of that, we are looking for a new, a new home. It's miraculous the way we got that one, if you know the story. In the middle of a pandemic shutdown, economic blizzard, when so many church plants were having to close their doors, by the grace of God, the internal resilience of our church, many of whom you have never met, and the external resilience of our support base in terms of prayer and financial giving, uh, that's you, which many people inside the church have not met. Uh, those two graces of God have really established us to be in this position. So by God's grace in September, we will have venue shopped and landed a new home that will be our next temporary home. You're always on the move here, right? There's no such thing as building ownership only in, in rarer uh, circumstances here. But for a new church plant, you know, we're going to be on the move. And that's kind of, that's part of it. But uh, where we are on the move to next remains to be seen, but we are going to knock on doors around downtown Brooklyn. We need a transportation heavy environment. We have a lot of people from a lot of regions coming to the church. We've had over 40 new people come to church for the very first time just since the start of this year. That's more than all, uh, all previous months combined uh, for our church plant. So a lot of good is moving and shaking here and we are so excited for it. All right, this is the two and a half, three minute monthly minute this month but lots of fun things going on. Please continue to pray, support, encourage, give. It is all hands on deck thing as we look towards September and Lord willing, we'll look up in the fall and there will be a new fully fledged church plant in New York City. Way to go team. I am so thankful and humbled and excited. We'll talk soon.